This time we're supposed to convert hexadecimal numbers to binaries. Anytime you convert hexadecimal number to binary, you're supposed to convert every single digit of hexadecimal number to four bit binary number. What I mean by that? Let's say if I have 41, I have 41, you're supposed to convert every digit of hexadecimal number to four bits. So four in binary is zero, one, zero, zero. And one in binary is zero, 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 one. So if this is your hexadecimal number, base 16, this is your binary number. Let me explain you why. We have 0, 1, 0, 0, and I have 0, 0, 0, 1. If you want to convert this number to, to the decimal digit, this is going to be 1, 2, 4, 8. So we're supposed to just add the numbers or the weights which are above 1s. So I have just 4, that's why this is 4. And I have 1, 2, 4, 8. Again, I'm supposed to look at the weights which are above 1s. That's why I have just 1 over here. That's why this is 41. Let's take a look at this example. I have 65. Again, I'm supposed to convert every single hexadecimal digit to 4 binaries. 6 in binary is 0, 1, 1, 0. 5 in binary is 0, 1, 0, 1. This is base 16 and this is base 2. This is my answer. If you want to verify it, copy this down. 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1. This is 1, 2, 4, 8. 4 plus 1 gives me 5. And I have 1, 2, 4, 8. 4 plus 2 gives me 6. So this is my binary number, which is corresponding to this value 65 base 16. Let's take a look at A7. Anytime we have the alphabetic characters, we're supposed to keep in mind that A represents 10, B represents 11, C represents 12, D represents 13, E 14, and F 15. Okay, so I have A 7. A, we said, is representing number 10. That's why I have 1, 0, 1, 0. This is binary 10. And 7 is 0, 1, 1, 1, base 2. Let's verify this one more time. We have 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1. So I have 1, 2, 4, 8. Remember, anytime you want to convert binary number to decimal, you're supposed to simply add weights which are above 1. So I have 8 plus 2 is equal 10, but we have to express the answer in terms of the hexadecimal number. 10 is A. This one is 1, 2, 4, 8. 4 plus 2 plus 1 is 7. That's why this is hexadecimal 7. So, a7 in binary looks like this. This is the solution to this problem.